I'm Anil Kumar and here is a test question on periodic function. This question is valid for any periodic function, not necessarily sinusoidal. The question here is, suppose h is a periodic function with period of 24. If h of 4 equals to 22 and h of 8 equals to 30, find each function's value. You need to find value the function h28 part b is h of 80, h of minus 20 and h of 56. I like you to pause the video and then answer this question. My suggestion is that if you're looking for a periodic function that means the values repeat after the period and we know the time period t is equals to 24. So after every 24 these values are going to repeat. We are given two values for this particular function h of 4 and h of 8. So to find any one of these values, we have to write uh, that number in terms of 24 plus minus something, right? So h of 28 could be written as one full cycle of 24 plus plus 4, right? Since the function is periodic, after every 24, the numbers will repeat. So we'll get the value as h of 4, and h of 4 is given to us as 22. So we get this answer as 22. So we get the point, right? Now, if you want to find h of 2080, what will you do? So, you should get 24 plus 24 plus 24, correct? Likewise. So, let's go each cycle. So, 24 plus 24 is 48 plus 24 is 72. And 72 plus 8 will be 80. So, that means we could write this as h of 8, right? So, there are 1, 2, 3 cycles and then you get to the value h of 8. So h of 8 is given to us as 30, so this answer is 30, correct? So that is how you should be answering this particular question. Now when we say h of minus 20, we can go backwards also, it's periodic, correct? So we could write this as minus 24, and then if I add 4 to it, I get h of minus 20. So therefore, this could be written as h of 4, and that is 22, correct? 56. So 56 you could get by combinations of 24, which is 24 plus 24 is 48. 48 plus 8 is 56. So this is equals to age of 8. Is it okay? So age of 8 is 30. So that is how such questions can be answered. I hope it's absolutely clear. I'm Anil Kumar. Now try out some multiple choice questions. And all the best for your test. Thank you.